Welcome everybody to a short video, a part of Doom Raiders week two. I just want to do a little video here before I go out for the day and I'm busy and I can't upload or do anything. So we're doing a little video with the dual wielding mod and I'm trying to put together some OP combos of just two of the same weapon. Now we can combine one weapon that's OP and another weapon that's OP and just dual wield it. But no, I want to try and combine two of the same weapon starting with the Hellabut cannon. And uh, we're going to be using the flash rounds from Calamity, which give off a concussive blast that confuses enemies in a large Large area for a short time now hopefully this doesn't break my game because uh, this is gonna be a lot of shots we're shooting out we're gonna take on the golem and we're just gonna let it rip I have 20 frames per second his health is barely moving so far this is uh, not the greatest combo it is one of the more destructive combos in terms of frame rate we're gonna switch to bullets now we're gonna use boomerang bullets from the juice mod and hope that it really works because i don't know if it's gonna work okay damage dps oh my god i've never seen such a big barrage of bullets before and they come right back at me you think that'd be kind of dangerous honestly but i know there's a bug with the juice mod boomerang bullets where you get the bullets back Know, like they don't really disappear so if i open my inventory we might end up with more bullets than what we started with so uh just let that be known for anyone that does a playthrough with the juice mod you have that mod in there you use some boomerang bullets you get some of those bullets back but yeah the damage doesn't seem like the greatest you have to really get in there get in between his cheeks if you know what i'm saying how many bullets we ended up with we got 4,000 and almost 300 more bullets back you know i'm kind of scared of this next set of bullets and this next set of gun but uh fuck it you know maybe I, it's about time i made a new creative world because if you guys watched the last the crate video the fishing crate video this world is bugged something about the world is bugged i don't know maybe i didn't defeat enough bosses it is in hard mode that is for sure a thing because i've done stuff in hard mode on this world but yeah we're using uh laser drill bullets always shoot straight towards your cursor 230 percent pickaxe power with the shredder let's just tap it once it didn't do anything okay maybe we're blessed so we got saved right there i wanted to see what kind of bullshit was gonna go down but nothing happened so i think we're blessed let's go ahead let's summon in golem again he's gonna be the star of our episode today oh i don't think any bullets has special effects with the shredder the shredder is more of like less of a shredder towards enemies health bars and more of a shredder towards frame rate He's actually not doing right too bad on frame rate. The hell of a cannon with the concussive round is doing more. Or the flash round is doing more. This, I'm, I'm managing a solid 50 frames while doing decent damage to him. But uh, it's really loud and I, I can't hear anything if I'm being honest. I might go deaf after this episode. But it's all worth it, right? For Game Raiders Week. <laughs> We're going to try out these illustrious knives. One of the most beautiful throwing weapons in the game. When you have Calamity installed. And these things hurt. I didn't even get to dual wield. That was just single wield. What happens if we... Let's do the Ravager. We, he dies real quick too. Oh my god. That was the Ravager. I know the Ravager gets stronger over time. But that dude just got his cheeks smashed. So we're using the Destiny Weaver from Thorium. There's like a whole paragraph to read. But let's just hold left click and right click. And see what happens. Sounds kind of scary. All right, let's put it to the test, though. Let's see. That weapon is really strong. I mean, it does say Reality Breaker. So I'm assuming it's going to destroy everything in its path. We're going to try out the Dance of Blades. And then I think we might just end the video off of that. This doesn't seem any crazier than what it usually is. Oh, actually, no. It is. This looks like a fucking... <laughs> a game like you're playing castlevania or something you're on the last level i don't know ghouls and goblins let's see its damage performance while actually hitting golem too it's not too bad i mean given this is a post moon lore weapon probably should be a little stronger you know what i'm saying but uh it's all good i still like it i still have love for the dance of blades but yeah short little video because i want to make sure i got a video off for today i hope you guys enjoyed leave in the comments for sure leave in the comments some good ass dual wielding ideas some good dual wielding ideas so we could do another video actually i'm gonna leave you guys with one more thing all right see this thing this was requested so we're, we're gonna do it we're gonna get the hell about cannon back yeah, we're gonna get two of them this was requested in another video and i wanted to leave you know most video i leave open for more ideas so we can do a part two if we need to but you know let's just do it now because i know you guys want to see this now and uh just fuck my world am i right